In Nakuru, Kenya, we have this awesome and really skilled lady photographer who goes by the name Lady Photographer. My name is Wangoi Gishoro. I am a photographer based in Nakuru, Kenya, and this is my story. Well, Wangoi Gishuru will today be sharing with us about her passion for photography and how it all started. So this has been a really long journey, <laughs> very long. Uh, I started off as a hobbyist. Actually, it's my father who nurtured this talent. He used to like buy me a camera all the time. Like we always constantly used to have a camera at home and I was like the bona fide family photographer. So it started just as a hobby, but as I grew and I started pursuing my career, I realized that this is something that could make me money. So after university and then jobs are not coming through, I got a job at a commercial studio in Nairobi, and that's where I can say I got rooted into this trade as a money-making venture. Every time I say I quit, something always comes up that calls for me to pick up my camera. And once I start shooting and clicking, all the joy is restored and I realize why I cannot quit because it's what gives me happiness. Now, everything is not always smooth. Some people still have some prejudice when they first meet her. And so here is her experience. So two things that people not always do photography and it's, okay, I've come to accept it. First, it's my height. Secondly, I'm a woman. So my height like, and I'm like, well, watch any pig and then utaona. So they have this cut thing that maybe I cannot deliver, maybe I cannot get the shot that they anticipate for until now they see the photos. So the reaction when people receive the final products of my job is what keeps me going because yeah, and then the job that they, they're handed over is like, wow, I did not expect that. So that keeps me going. It gives me hope for a better tomorrow because every time it's like a new chance you're given over and over again. Like no one is believing in you and then you give them the job and then the trust is restored. It's a cycle and it's, it works for me. I love it. I'm used to that. I don't even notice it anymore. Well, apart from the low lights, photography has actually taken Wangoi Gishuru to places and even made her meet people she never thought she'll actually meet and places she never thought she'll go to. Well, photography has been... I can't even explain it, but it has taken me places I never thought maybe I'd ever get there. Put me before great men and women. I've, I've been able to photograph the president, the first lady, big people in this country, ambassadors, and all because of the camera. Photography has put me in the same room with great men and women. I've been in the same room with uh, Rasa Michelle, uh, Mokami Kemathi. That's a very major highlight for me because, wow, that woman, her story, so 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 inspiring so those are sort of my major highlights and amazingly so my major highlights in photography are from unpaid gigs gigs that you did not charge for but you just happen to be somewhere with a camera those are my greatest moments for me so now here is the story behind the brand name lady photographer wow the name lady photographer funny story so uh, my BFF and I, Caleb, we were just brainstorming on some ideas about uh, empowering young, young women who are taking up uh, skills that could be termed as odd jobs, um, uh, jobs that are regarded more as male-oriented. So when we came up with Lady Photographer, it was, uh, it was supposed to be a platform to empower young women interested in photography and videography. It's a platform designed to, to empower women who think that photography or videography is meant for men. So we were just like encouraging young ladies, take it up. If you have the passion, do it. Do not regard it that it's a, it's a man job. Uh, and as time moved on, the name stuck and I decided, uh, well, it's a good name. People identify it with me. So why not go the business way with it as well? And yeah, it's, it, it sticks. 
it has a way that drinks with people and every time you mention lady photographer, ah, ah no, look at the company, eh, hey, ni lady photographer. And you're, you're sure that person won't forget that name. Wow, that's great. And so remember, we cannot end this segment without getting to hear about her vision and her ultimate dream. And so here's the vision and the ultimate dream for lady photographer. Actually, my ultimate dream is to have an all ladies team. Like women who will do everything from cooking, okay, you're too heavy, for reception, the person who welcomes you is a lady, the person who takes your photos is a lady, the person who delivers you is a lady. When you go out there, the people who will be doing all our jobs will be ladies. And uh, thankfully, we are working towards that. So far, I have two female colleagues who we are working with. And yeah, it's a step towards realizing that dream. So number one, before you embark on doing anything, always have passion for it. Don't jump into the bandwagon because you think it's trendy, you think it will, it's quick cash. Uh, sorry, this photography doesn't have quick cash. It might for a day or two, but then you have two dry months. So if you're doing it for the money, you're in the wrong in the wrong way because you'll give up soon so for anyone with the passion of photography do it Fight, align yourself with people who will support your dream people who will mentor you people who will help you to enhance your skills do not give up on your passion because passion pays you can look at me my passion is what is paying my bills right now i did not do photography in school I did something totally different, but it's my passion that's paying off. So if you have a passion, be disciplined about it. Pursue it with all you have. If you can, uh, if you're in a position to acquire a camera, do. Because you only get better at photography by shooting. You get better by doing. Your, your, your best shot, Bado Uje, capture. You'll always capture it in future. To do a bigger picture, you think, wow, this is a deadly shot. And then Kisho Pigengine, it will be better than this. So pursue your passion, work on it, and be disciplined. I love us, how God. Always pray to God. Let him guide you. Wow, thank you so much, lady photographer. Thank you for the good work that you're doing. Thank you for inspiring both ladies out there as well as we men. You are actually challenging us, and we are so happy for your work. Thank you so much for watching this video. Be inspired to live out your purpose on earth. Get to identify what you really love and ensure you're making an impact in this world through your passion. Our services generally include photography and videography for events and um, corporates also, even humanitarian projects, we also do that. We have a studio here, just behind me, that's where our studio is based. We do all sorts of photography from family shoots, newborn, baby bump, you name it, anything you want, just like Nakumat, we have it.